back to Fresh Start Friday. Right now, we're going to give you all a fresh start and some fresh breath. Let's talk about what causes bad breath and how you can get rid of it. Just in general, bad breath is caused by bacteria, right? Yeah. It gets in the mouth and the teeth and sometimes in, in the bloodstream okay. and, and your breath. So the stronger, the more pungent the thing that we eat, mm -hmm. the more pungent your breath might be. Okay. Right? Garlic has the worst reputation mm -hmm. for causing bad breath. But we know what that. other foods are notorious for causing bad breath? Okay, well, obviously onions, mm -hmm. right? We know that. I eat a lot of those too. Right, but here's something probably people didn't know cauliflower. Really? Yeah, Brussels sprouts. They all contain those stinky sulfur compounds. Okay. What about coffee? Coffee mm -hmm. is bad, but why is it bad? Well, two things. You kind of get a double whammy. One, it, it dries your mouth. You ever notice when you drink coffee, your mouth gets dry? Yes. So a dry mouth actually promotes the growth oh, of bacteria. Okay. And the other thing is it also has these sulfur compounds in it. So are there any foods that we can eat that actually contribute to good breath? Okay, so parsley. Parsley good. is good. Yeah, it and can counteract your garden. And mint. mint. And the other thing is a lot of people don't realize milk and water. Okay. It neutralizes the compounds that we had okay. in garlic, you know, those sulfur compounds gotcha. we were talking mm -hmm. about. But also, apples are really good at counteracting bacteria. Mm -hmm. Right. So. We're going to try something. You want to do a little test? Oh, boy. We're going to take a bite of an onion. We're going to do it together. Okay. We'll do the red onion. We'll do the red onion. And we got to eat the onion first. Yeah, go. we know how Ready, bad. Ready, go. Mm. Oh, my God. It's really good. Mmm. 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 Okay. Ready? Hang on. <laughs> Ready? <laughs> Our first awkward right. TV moment, right? That wasn't, wasn't too bad. All right, one at a time. Go, go. Stink. I know. Stink. Of course they do. Okay, you look much better. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so now we're supposed to eat that. So, uh -huh. uh -huh. mm -hmm. mm. come on. I've never heard this before. Are you telling the truth? No, of course I'm telling. I'm on lives on TV. Right. <laughs> really, Doctor Steve? Mm -hmm. All right. You go ahead. <sighs> nice. Give me to me. Give it to me. Yeah, I don't smell the onion. Right? Okay. It, this uh, is honestly, cool. it totally killed right. the onion smell. Yeah. So pack some apples, right? That's a good little trick. That's a good trick, actually. Right. Just learn something. Mm -hmm. Okay, so what about should we chew gum or right. should we have a mint? Chewing gum stimulates saliva production, mm -hmm. right? Uh, more than sucking on a mint. So the moisture is the thing that you want. Remember we talked about the dry oh, mouth, right? right? So if your mouth is moist, you'll have less of a problem with the bacteria. So gum wins out over mints. Listen, we might not have saved the world, but at least we have saved a few people out there who have some stanky breath. That's right. For more <laughs> Fresh Start Friday, stick around after this.